What is going on guys? Skip here and welcome back to another episode in our Road to Glory series. Today we're back with some white ball cricket as we kick off the first of three T20s against Sri Lanka at Lords. And if you have joined us in the last few episodes, you would have seen that we've wiped the floor with them in the test. We've cleaned up the one day series. So today we go for three for three and send them packing with their tails between their legs. We're 99 overall. The form is good. I'm excited about this challenge. We've really turned it around in the white ball arena, so hopefully some wickets and some runs today. Ladies and gents, we're not going to mess around here. I don't know how many T20s we're going to get through, but hey, it's the career of Robin DeBank. Just get your feet up, grab yourself a cold one, and then just enjoy Robin DeBank. So it's back to Lords to take on Sri Lanka yet again. We are not the captain of this team. However, they have given us the new ball. We will be following Chris Jordan for over number two. And I'm excited about bowling on this wicket because you can barely see it at the home of cricket. Big Malta and Wayno out in the middle. Sri Lanka called tails. We know it never fails. And on this occasion, we get the toss on a medium grassy one. 21 degrees, a little bit of breeze. The perfect night to play cricket as we choose to have a bat we'll keep it at that and hopefully the rdb can fire up so swindles and pepper to get us going i don't think we're going to have a bat in this series so we'll pick up play in the second over with the ball and we'll have a look at the scorecard 153 for two off our 20 overs pepper getting 95 not out a little salty that we didn't have a bat wow the zingers are coming all episode nasanka faces up first ball we're not gonna mess around you know the rules and it's a dot to mid off and the Sunker, five off three. Jay Sakari, yet again, we change the field. Go heavy leg side, and that's thrash to extra cover. No run. We can get through this set of six. Confidence high. We're flying. Short ball cramps him up yet again. This is a good start from Robin. Because we're not captain, I highly doubt that we'll be batting in this series. As we go short again this time, he top edges it. It's low, it's flat. It's six runs into the members, you pig. Well, Sri Lanka have been good with bat. They've found ways to pump us down the ground. They've got their top edges in place. They're doing it all, but they're just not winning. Well, I thought it went for six. It's gone for four. We roll him for the last of the first. We get the nip back a go, and he drives to cover point. No run, no worries. Two are done in Sri Lanka. A 12 for one. So they need 7.47. We've got to halt their scoring here as we start with the slow ball dot to point. How does the captain use us? I don't know. Probably bowl the back end. These overs as well. That's a corker. Just standing that ball up on the seam. It nips back nicely. Can we get a control? C control V. No, he glides it, cuts it, slashes it down the third man. It won't go all the way. It is the longest part of the boundary. They back for three poor running. So just the couple. He should not be on strike. As we go in for the toes here, it's a low fully for another dot. Not going to say anything. Just hold your breath. Back of a length. Take some pace off. There's another dot ball. The last of our second. No way. Economical at best. We work this one to mid wicket. It's three off the over. We close out the fourth. And it's 30 for one. So that was the spell that we probably didn't need. Momentum's everything in sport. And the captain's just taken it away from us. 99 for three. We don't mess around. They still need about eight and over as we're in. And we're getting work leg side for another dot. Well, it's a short, sharp cricket here. 55 or 41 as we burst in. He slashes to point. There's another dot ball. I'm going to try something here. I've taken cover point out. Going to swing it into the shins, and he's going to smash it straight through that gap that we've given him. Does it go all the way for four? Just hole up and make it two. We'll take it. So the 100 up. They're in a good position here, Sri Lanka. We're going to continue to fire in, and he's going to continue to blast it out. This time, he doesn't get all of it again. Another couple. We'll battle this. We'll see if he wants to take on the back foot drive. Have to angle it over middle and leg. No, he gets bat on ball. Good bowling. You can't say that we're not doing it for the country here. Last about 30 drags it on. We'll ask the question. Well bowled. And well, just the three overs, and we've managed to get the win. Pepper rolls in, picks up his thousand. Actually, I think we've lost. What is going on here? This game is just Simon, and Simon far too quickly cooked. 24 is back in 
and Sri Lanka have ended up winning by six wickets. How on earth have we not bowled a fourth over there? With the in-form bowler, we've gone none for absolute peanuts off three overs. Peppers batted 95 not out of 68 balls. Get yourself 130, you idiot. England lose by six wickets, and rightly so. Well, I'll tell you what, we are fired up at the control decks here. We get stuck into game two, Sri Lanka call heads. England get the toss. Hey, why don't you roll in and have a bat again so we only make 100 off our 20 overs. Everyone gets a red ink and then everyone's happy. No, we're going to have a bowl. Give the ball to Robin and let's fire up. So Siri Wadana, he faces the RDB. Bit of a change up to the lineup. It's one over six on the board, and Robin doesn't mess around. We're going fast, full, and at the stumps as he gets a thick outside edge, it misses everyone catching, and it's a dot ball, a third man. We're back bowling with the bog standard field. In we go. Nip back. Oh, that is beautiful. I tell you what, Siri Wardan is not looking forward to this. We get another one going. All he plays and misses. Just kick him over. Please just kick these stumps over, brother. You don't deserve to be here as he just works this one into the wide mid on region, gets down the other end and off the mark. Economical. We'll go the bouncer. Bog standards. You get bat on ball. Now he French cuts it for four. Should have known that as well. Well, if you've been a long time watcher, you would have seen the improvement that this bloke's made. As we roll him for the last of our first, he's just going to press that through extra cover across the practice wickets. They'll keep it at one. No, they're back for two. They keep it at one. No overthrows. Two are done. That's 12 for none. So we're given an over off. We bowl down the other end. We nip one back first up to Jay Sakara for a dot. Well, yet again, you'd think that we'll just find our pace, our zone, and just dot them up. Hopefully, the wickets will come here. He gets his inside edge single down the other end. We go short. There's another dot ball. This is beautiful from Robin. Well, we have just been given the captaincy for the one-day team. I don't think the T20 captaincy is far away. As we get worked down a fine leg, that'll just be one more than a sunker looking frustrated. So just the two off the over. Maximum eight. We take it as a dub as he gets an inside edge dot ball. We'll wrap up the fifth, the power play, and it's 28 for one. So power play officially done now. 46 for one. We still haven't taken a proper wicket apart from the run out, and that's a good dot to start. Well, the RDB career is all about progression, maturity, growing up, and just being the best that we can. And I think little phases like this where although we're not taking a wicket, but we're showing major improvement with our skill, hey, that's all we can ask for. It's almost as good as taking a wicket. None for nine. We dig in deep and we get him to inside edge onto the ribs. He can take his single. Still going at 7.3, so it's a decent start. Halfway through as we get work leg side. We've got three men out there. You're kidding me. That's gone to the fence. Oh, well fielded. The pat back pick up, and they're back for two. And now Jay Sakara looking to attack. Slower ball nip away. He's up ish. Have we got a sweeper out there? We do. It's just beautiful captaincy here from Robin. Well, when he's bowling, that is. So six off, 17 balls. Another slower one. And he just turned the corner. Keep it at a single. Seven are done. And Sri Lanka, 53 for one. But here we go. Bought in for our last over. 125 for two. Nasanka still there. Savant faces. We go into his toes and he clips us off his legs all the way for six. That is massive. So not... The best start there. We go short. Oh, he swats it down the ground. What is that shot? Well, we dig it in. I tell you what, I do not mind this from the Sri Lankan. He just goes, Adam Gilchrist to Harmus and hits it off his finger. Good stuff. And the sunk of the real aggressor here. He'll probably top edge this over the keeper. Oh, no. Inside edge onto the rib cage. Just run, boy. Get off strike. No. Come back for two. Just try and kill this over. Two balls left, and he launches over mid on that. Has gone an absolute mile. So 16 off our last. None for 31. I'll tell you what, we've bowled 20. Catch that. 24 balls. Oi. It's gone for 31. It's a positive. The spell is done. And now we sim all the way through. And are we going to be called in with the bat? I think we are. Seven Balls left. Robin D. Business out in the middle. We need 15 from 7. Siri Wanda. 
He bowls. We've just got to get bat on ball here as he looks to just push it in. Oh, no, we've run ourselves out. Always oh, missed the stumps. Oh, my days, what is happening? And just like that, ladies and gents, we've ended up winning. We don't face a ball in the last over. It looks like, is that Sam Curran or oh, I don't know, he's crook as hell anyway. 33 off 16. Cook 24 has done it again. Sri Lanka 159 for two. And the three Lions 161 for six. So it's Old Trafford for the third and final T20. The series is locked at 1-1. Very much like the one day is. It comes down to game three heroics and the RDB has been there before. Sri Lanka win the toss on this occasion. Medium standard, 18 degrees. Plenty of breeze. They're going to have a bowl. Get the boys to set. Are we required with that? Probably not. Ladies and gents, let's get this one going. So the crowd are into it. Oh, Swindles out for a duck thing. Shana does his thing. Looks like he's picked up three. We don't get a look with the bat. 160 on the board. So it's been, well, not a massive run scoring series, but we'll just call it even Steven skill-wise all over the board. Robin the business. He picks up play. In the second over, three off the first. We don't change the field, and we're going to get sneaked down a third man for four. Well, with the sun beaming in our face, that just breaks our heart. We roll in second up. Ball nips back. He'll take the single J of Sakara, and this is not a bowling innings we need to get hit for runs. We have been really good. Really good. Third ball in. Oh, he looks to thrash. Take some pace off. No run. One positive about this series is that we actually face the ball. Fifth ball in, oh, we plays and misses. Well, we haven't seen too many plays and misses throughout the test series in the one day. We've got our full quota here in the T20s as he tucks that around the corner to finish up our second. It'll be a single seven off. Sri Lanka a 10 for none. A Siri Wardana. Had him in all sorts last game. Oh, this time he's just going to plonk it to cover. No, he doesn't move his feet, and he's going to get it dribbling through the gap for four. Well, Sri Lanka just picking away at Robin here. We get a handy dot ball. We'll go short this time. He picks it up, and he's gone. We've picked up a wicket finally, ladies and gents, in the third and final T20 as well. When you need it most, the king stands up. Short ball, keep square leg up. He's no good, this bloke. He got away with a boundary. Well, over the top there, Danny Lawrence. But, hey, it's the third T20. We're looking for a three-for-three three series sweep of the tourists and Siri Wardana. Well, he was not the answer to Sri Lanka's top order woes. Savant, he can play. What's he got first ball? A dot to the man at midweek. And who's fired up after a good catch? The three dots. In a row, chuck a wicket in there as well as he looks to lob over cover. Dot ball. The last of the second. Keep your head in it. Short ball. Oh, yeah, beautiful stuff. Four and done. Sri Lanka at 26 for two. So eight and a half and over. The sunker faces as he goes short. He does. He lollipops it. Oh, they look at each other. The fielders. Is this going to go for four? No, they'll keep it at two. Beautifully fielded yet again. The single. Third ball, slower ball, and he works it down a fine leg. We've plugged that gap as well. Later into our spell, that one goes for four. We go short again at the throat here. Two balls left. Yeah, beautifully bowled. So seven balls left in the summer for England. Yorker. Oh, gets flogged to the man at deep mid-wicket. It wraps up the sixth. The power play in Sri Lanka are 43 for two. Sam Curran, the hero of last match. Do we get another crack here? We do, and we're going to bowl our allotted overs before the 10 over mark. We're just going to drop mid off back. Where's that square leg? He's going to go to the fence, and then we can bring that cover point across and then take a bit of a risk as we bowl into the pads and hips of the Sri Lankan batsman. Angle is good. Pace is fast, hit the deck, and he thrashes us over mid on for a one bounce four. So all that planning for that, and Sri Lanka is still a sniff. Short ball catch that, just a single and no overthrows. We'll get down the keeper's end. Just trying to combat all glitches in cooked 24. Oh, he swats again. He's going to get away with it. <laughs> Well, cross your fingers. 
Cross your toes. The last ball of our lot. It is in and work leg side. That'll be a single. Sri Lanka are going to need 86 off 10 overs here. And the RDB can do nothing about it. Apart from field his backside off. We close up. Tra Travaskis is in. He takes wickets. And it looks like Sri Lanka have got the goods here. 87 not out to Nasankara. Don't even want to look at it. We lose the series. We go 2-1. and one in the test one day and t20 series but when you're not the captain of your country things just go wrong and have a look at that sri lanka win by five wickets and take the series 2-1 well it's been good playing the hundred the t20 blast etc but there's nothing better when it's for your country sri lanka too good on this occasion the rdb is getting better at the short form but have a look at the calendar now and well, the big fella deserves a bit of a break before heading back down under to take on the Australian domestic. But 99 overall, he's 26 years old, 205 centimetres. He's got a decent resume so far. We've just got to keep supporting the king. Ladies and gents, we're going to leave it there for today's episode. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Leave a cheeky comment down below. And make sure you swing over and catch us in one of our live streams as well. Well, but until the next time, look after yourselves and those around you. I'll catch us in the next one.